Forbidden World, originally titled Mutant, is a 1982 American science fiction horror film. The screenplay was written by Tim Kernan, from a screen story by R. J. Robertson and Jim Wynorski. It was co-edited and directed by Alan Holzman, who had edited Battle Beyond the Stars two years earlier. The cast includes Jesse Vint, Don Dunlap, June Chadwick, Lyndon Chiles, Fox Harris, and Michael Bowen. Forbidden World has also been released under the titles Mutant and Subject 20. The film received three nominations for the 1983 Saturn Awards, Best Low Budget Film, Best Makeup and Best Special Effects. It was generally panned by critics as a cheap, exploitive imitation of the movie Alien, with sex, nudity, uneven editing, cheap special effects, and an audio track that some found unpleasant. It is frequently paired with and compared to the previous year's Corman-produced alien rip-off Galaxy of Terror, with which Forbidden World shares some of the same sets designed by James Cameron. The movie also makes use of footage recycled from the 1980 movie Battle Beyond the Stars, which was also produced by Corman. It is notable for its gruesome violence, oddball electronica music score by Susan Justin available in full as a DVD-ROM feature on the German release of the film, odd, choppy editing and a scene in which the two female leads take a shower together. The film was remade in 1991 under the title Dead Space, on which Corman served as executive producer. The remake has minor variations but still retains the plot and character stylings of the original, also referring to the mutated virus as a metamorph, as the original did. Topic. Plot In the distant future, at a genetic research station located on the remote desert planet of Zarbia, a research team has created an experimental lifeform they have designated Subject 20. This lifeform was built out of the synthetic DNA strain Prota B and was intended to stave off a galaxy-wide food crisis. However, Subject 20 mutates rapidly and uncontrollably and kills all of the laboratory subject animals before cocooning itself within an examination booth. After Subject 20 hatches from its cocoon, it begins killing the personnel at the station, starting with the lab tech charged with cleansing the subject lab of the dead animal test subjects. Professional troubleshooter Mike Colby, accompanied by his robot assistant Sam 104, is called in to investigate the problem. After Colby settles in, his decision to terminate Subject 20 to prevent further deaths is met with research-minded secrecy and resistance. The staff of the station includes the head of research, Gordon Hausa, his assistant Barbara Glazer, lab assistant Tracy Baxter, the station head of security and Cal Timbergen, the chief of bacteriology. As Subject 20 continues to kill most of the station crew, the reason for the deception is revealed. Subject 20's genetic design incorporates human DNA, and its method of killing is to inject its prey with the Prota-B DNA strain which then proceeds to remove all genetic differences within specific cells. The result is that the victim's living body slowly erodes into gelatinous pile of pure protein which Subject 20 consumes for sustenance. After its final mutation, where the creature evolves into a huge insect-like being with a large mouth full of sharp teeth, the creature is slain when it eats Cal's cancer-ridden liver, its body genetically self-destructing from within. Mike and Tracy are the only survivors. <laughs> Topic. Cast Jesse Vint as Mike Colby Don Dunlap as Tracy Baxter June Chadwick as Dr. Barbara Glazer Lyndon Chiles as Dr. Gordon Hausa Fox Harris as Dr. Cal Timbergen Raymond Oliver as Brian Beale Scott Pollan as Earl Richards Michael Bowen as Jimmy Swift Don Oliveira as Sam 104 Topic. Production 
According to director Alan Holzman he began shooting without a script with these directions from Corman, you have four days to write, produce and direct a seven to eight minute opening of a space movie, I'll give you an astronaut and a robot, and if you need any inspiration, I've always wanted to do a version of Lawrence of Arabia in outer space. Topic. Reception Review aggregation website Rotten Tomatoes gives the film a rating of 60% based on reviews from five critics. The Los Angeles Times called it lively, amusingly gruesome. Topic. Home media On July 20, 2010, Shout! Factory released Forbidden World on both DVD and Blu ray disc. The DVD is a two-disc set. This set also includes the original Alan Holzman cut that was rejected by Roger Corman due to having humor, while Corman wanted the film to be done as a straight sci-fi, horror film. This is the first time this cut is available anywhere.